Hey everybody, it's me, Megan, and we are doing this springtime look today, so we're going to go ahead and get started. The very first thing that we're going to use is my Upside Down Urban Decay Primer Potion. I'm going to put this all over my lid, and this just helps my eyeshadow last longer and helps it from creasing. Now I'm going to go into my Neutral 28 palette using that pink color up there, and I'm going to apply that all over my lid. And what we're going to do is we're going to make sure it's really packed on really good. Now going into my MAC eyeshadow, and this color is called Saddle, using a fluffy eyeshadow brush. I'm going to apply this directly into my crease and blend out. Now using my Neutral 28 color palette with that plum color there, using a pencil brush, I'm going to go in and just kind of outline my crease to create a cut crease look. This part you really want to take your time with because you want to make sure this area is really defined. This is going to be super pretty when it's finished. So I'm just going to take your time and blend out any of the harsh lines on the upper part of the shadow right there leading up to the highlight you want to make sure that's quite soft so blend that out as much as you can now using that reddish brown color we're going to go ahead and apply that directly on top of that plummy color and blend it all together so I'm applying that in the crease area Using my 88 Professional Palette by Beauty Treats for the highlight, we're going to use that color there. And I'm going to apply this directly underneath my brow and blend it down into the crease to blend the two colors together. Taking my fluffy brush, I'm just going to blend the colors together so they won't be as harsh. We want them to be as seamless as possible. I'm just doing more blending from my highlight to my crease, just going back and forth. Using wool, I'm going to apply this directly into my crease to warm up that area using my fluffy green brush. Now for my inner tear duct area, we're going to be using Max Extra Dimension Skin Finish and this color is called Superb. This is a limited edition product. You can use whatever color you have that's similar to this to apply in your inner tear duct. This is pretty much it. Now we're going to be ready for eyeliner using my Jordana Fabu Liner in black. This has a felt tip which makes it easy for you to apply your winged eyeliner. And we're going to apply a little bit of mascara on my top lashes. Just a light layer. Because we are going to prep for our lashes next. I'm going to be using my oral lashes and these lashes here are called Barbie. They're quite dramatic but I love them. I'm going to be using my Dark Tone Duo Lash Glue and I'm just going to wiggle the lash around to prepare them to apply them on my lid. So that is what they look like on. I absolutely love these. And so just apply a light layer of mascara on your bottom lashes. Now we're ready for our lips. Using my EOS Lip Balm, I'm going to prep my lips for color. Um, I'm going to apply some lip liner first. This one is by NYX, but I forgot the name of the color. So look in the description below because I'm going to have the name of that there where you can check that out. So as you can see, I'm just going to line my lips because we're going to, you know, use a light color. So I want it to look as natural as possible. So I'm just going to line that like that. And we're going to prep for our lipstick just blend it out so it won't be as harsh. Now this color is by MAC and it's called Snob, which is kind of like a really pinky lipstick. We're going to apply that and just blend that out. <laughs> now this is lip glass and it's called Bow by MAC and I'm going to apply that on top of my lipstick. 
make it nice and glossy looking. Ooh, yeah. Uh-huh, I got that on now, so they're looking bomb. Um, now I'm ready for my blush. <laughs> this is Stratus. This is a mineralized blush, and this is also limited edition. So I'm gonna just apply that on my cheeks there. And that is pretty much it. That is the final look. Really soft and a really pretty look. All information about the products that I use will be down in the description.